to another episode of this in our show. Now, I noticed that this news article came out. A lot of people are raging about it. A lot of fanboys are going crazy. That Konami said they're going to currently focus their attention to mobile gaming. They say fuck the millions and, well, shit, uh, so many people that support millions of damn uh, console gamers that support them over the year. They were known from the damn consoles and they just going to turn their back on us. It's basically showing that they slowly but slowly kind of tiptoe their way out of the goddamn shit, out of the fucking gaming division. They try to go do something else. They realize that it make you may you know it cost a lot of money to make a fucking game basically, and they just don't want to do it anymore. They cut ties with Kozima, which I'm quite sure you probably might get picked up by somebody else, party screen or something like that. But it's just they're cutting ties. They try to do their own thing, and they just. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised they start selling off some of their IPs pretty soon because they just wouldn't be this developer that just have micro transactions and have free to play games they think you can make a lot of money from doing that and I guess if you don't have that triple A game that come out and just sells Call of Duty numbers it's a risk these days that they just want to leave I mean to me personally I loved Kunami it was a pretty good damn company I mean, they gave America Solace. That you know, they gave us Rumble Roses. I believe they gave us the Street Cooter uh, Saga. That's where it was. That's uh, wait a minute, Sakoda. But um, like they going straight down, sinking the motherfucking boat. And you know, it's pretty sad due to the fact that we know for a fact that they said they was working on America so I doubt that they will make one now I cry sure if I won't be the pretty last one and it might be the end of the damn shit people playing video games some people don't you know after America so I disappear some people just going to quit playing video games it's just that type of game that you know that they love is a game that they changed their damn whole lives due to the fact that it's like one of the best series there is but I don't know, man. It's just stupid that they're going to turn their motherfucker back on everybody due to the fact that they just tire of it. I mean, if they could just sell off their IP to somebody confident to actually continue the legacy, it'd be good. But to leave their legacy like this and go to the mobile division is just horrible. I must rather them go bankrupt than go to the mobile division. Because, come on now, man. Mobile are the future, the way everybody say. But to be honest with you, I just like a lot of other people. I hate playing real games on my cell phone. I really do. It's just not fun at all to me. But me, you know, me and a lot of people are, you know, we just different. I see girls mostly playing on their cell phone, but they be playing games like Candy Crush. But I don't know, man. It's just this is a whole crazy ass situation. I knew they were going that route due to the fact that they did remove Kazima. I like, why would they do something that fucking stupid? Why would they cancel Silent Hill? You know, they cancel Silent Hill. A lot of people raising about that PT or whatever. I personally don't give a fuck. I hate Silent Hill. I'm not that type of guy that like to play horror games. I, I'll stay the fuck away from that shit. That's just how I am. But anyway, until you guys think about this, make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for supporting my channel. Peace out.